This video I want to talk about our electric paper cutters and the problem with them. Um, if you're in the middle of a cut and the blade stops before it gets down, if it's constantly stopping, you may have a problem with one of your cut buttons if it's not going through the complete cycle. And not even the way you'd want to test it to make sure it's not your blade too dull to go through the paper is do the cut process without paper. And if the blade still stops in the middle of a cut without even cutting paper, then you know something's happening. And it's probably one of your cut buttons is, is um, got a short in it. So basically, just what you want to do it, turn on your machine, take this front cover off. You can just kind of um, grab it on the edge and kind of pull it. Just grab it on the edge here and kind of pull it forward. And here it is down here. I've already taken it off to make this quicker. But you, you just pull the, the cover forward and it'll pop off. If you notice down in there, you'll see the main control board. And I'll show this thing here. You're going to be looking at these, these um, little lights here. One, each one of these little, one little light is for one cut button and the other is for another cut button. I'm going to go ahead and lower the shield. Well, actually, I don't have to. Okay, um, because we're not actually doing the cut. What I'm going to do is I'm going to push this, push and hold this right cut button, and I'm going to kind of shake back and forth, up and down, back as I'm pushing it in. Keep it pushed in all the way, and then just kind of shake it around. And you can see I'm going to push the cut button now. And when I did that, the light lit up. And you kind of shake it around. If the light flickers when you're shaking it around or blinks, you know there's a short in that button, and that's part of your problem. It's an open, not a short. And then you go to the other cut button and just try the same thing for it. And just kind of, it'll be a different light. And you kind of move the button around while you're holding it in and see if that light flickers at all. And that way you can determine which cut button is, is the problem if that light flickers. And that's basically it. Um, this video is published by NBKP International.